strange bug flying around. It's kind of a, it's a really strange one. Um, and landed on my refrigerator and I was able to catch him in my water bottle. I just poked a few little holes in here just to take a look at it. It looks almost like a mosquito eater type deal. But, um, you know, he looks like a big, big ant. He's weird. When I tore the paper off, I tore a piece of this paper off, he really responded to that and started flying around quite a bit. See a good look at him. See his wings? Um, years ago, I found a tarantula hawk wasp on the ground. It's, uh, bright blue. I wonder if there's like a relation. Maybe this is a wasp. I'm actually not sure. It's not kind of odd I was able to catch him. See his movie is weird. So what this turned out to be was an Ophion wasp, a caterpillar slayer. Uh, these things kill caterpillars, and ironically, a couple days before, I had uh, seen and killed the caterpillar. Go figure. Crazy. Here's another one of the same exact bug. He doesn't try to take revenge. What I'm curious is. Communicate. <laughs> How silly as that sounds, but. any way I can catch both of them. <laughs> well, not in the same jar, I mean. But, uh, the question is, what is it? <laughs> or what are they? What do you think? Do you think they were able to communicate? Yep. It's a bit of a mystery here. I suppose this one I can set free outside. And the other one. 
probably just gonna have to knock it out. Unless I can catch it and set it free too. Yeah. Okay, there's the little guy right there. Got him. Okay, it's in the bottle now. Dude. Just let it go outside. So what do you think? This is the Ophion wasp, the caterpillar slayer. I let it go outside, but I could have knocked it out. What do you think?